Good afternoon, folks. I'm really sorry. Technology is not playing ball this afternoon. I'm going to begin the meditation again so that you can enter into it fully and hopefully uninterrupted. I'm sorry we can't do this live today. It's just not playing ball. So I've invited us to consider approaching John the Baptist in the River Jordan. Approaching as we are ourselves as individuals so as you close your eyes try to visualize the scene that is before you perhaps you can hear the gentle lapping of the waters perhaps you can smell the air the water the banks of the river jordan perhaps you may hear the birds and maybe there'll be a short dialogue that will now take place between you and John the Baptist. So allow that scene now to play out for a short while. And as you come up out of the water, you now hear the voice of God the Father and he's speaking to you. He's speaking about you, to you. So listen. This is my child, says God the Father. And he uses your name. This is my child, the beloved, with whom I am well pleased. Now when Jesus heard these words, he hadn't even begun God the Father's work. We may love God, but let's not lose sight of the fact that he first loved us. So just take a moment now to reflect upon God's love for you. His love which is freely given. It's undeserved, but it's given without measure, nevertheless. And so reflect on his love for you. How does his love make you feel? What are you thinking? Tell God and then listen for anything he may say to you in response. God's love is unconditional. You can't earn it. There's nothing that you can do today to make God love you any more than he already does. His love is never ending. 
What truth do you think God wants you to hear today? Perhaps there's a particular aspect of his love that he wants you to take to heart today. Can you articulate what that, that may be? And how might you seek to live by this truth today? God doesn't want or expect us to struggle alone. He sends his Holy Spirit to those who ask and know him. So now you might want to have your palms open on your lap, facing up in an attitude of receiving God's Holy Spirit as you ask him to fill and refresh you. Ask the Holy Spirit for what you need, what you really need today. words of blessing as this meditation draws to a close however you may wish to continue this quiet time with the lord enjoy this sacred moment may you recognize in your life the presence power and light of your soul may you realize that you are never alone that your soul in its brightness and belonging connects you intimately with the rhythm of the universe. May you have respect for your individuality and difference. May you realise that the shape of your soul is unique, that you have a special destiny here, that behind the facade of your life there is something beautiful and eternal happening. May you learn to see yourself with the same delight, pride and expectation with which God sees you in every moment. Amen. God bless you and keep you all until we meet again. Amen.